from well, Windows 7. When you say radically different, you know that makes us excited and nervous at the same time. What are the differences <laughs> here? Know, well, in exactly. that opening shot, you saw the tiled look of the screen mm -hmm. when it first came up. Um, when you first turn on your computer, you'll be presented with that tiled view of the screen. So if you want to run the desktop, for example, to get to your icons and mm -hmm. everything, you click on the desktop app. Like gotcha, if you have a smartphone gotcha. like a smart or a phone. tablet. It is complete. It's a, now, okay, I did get an email from one of my radio show listeners mm -hmm. yesterday. He said, you're scaring the heck out of people about Windows 8. I've been using it for a few weeks now, and I love it. Well, oh, yeah, with that said, if you're an intermediate to advanced computer user mm -hmm. in about four or five days, you'll be able to move through Windows 8 very easily. Mm -hmm. If you're a novice or a casual user, it's going to be a couple weeks of brain twisting to get to the point where you're comfortable with it. Now, the trick here is, on October 26th, they're coming out with Windows 8. After they come out with Windows 8, if you want to get a computer with Windows 7 on it, it costs $150 more. Wow, so there's an upgrade charge. Yeah, so we launch our holiday special November 1st mm -hmm. every year. Most of our listeners to our radio show have told us they want Windows 7. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So how do we do that without charging them $150 extra? Well, we have to do a pre-launch event, a pre-order. This is the desktop only. We have two laptops coming too. Those are coming on November 1st. Got it. Uh, but the desktop, it was important for us to get this out and show mm -hmm. people how it works with Windows 8 and Windows 7 so they can come into our service centers and experience it and decide which one they want to have. Do you want me to flip yeah. the switch back on or not? Yeah, sure. Fire away. Okay. <laughs> All right. So Windows 8, you said it's really not going to be that bad. It just depends on your preferences. Windows 7, I want that over my current Windows version because... Well, if you have Windows Vista right now, mm -hmm. going to Windows 7 is going to be a significant upgrade for you. Your computer is going to run 20% faster the whole bit. There is no functional speed difference for the most part between mm -hmm. Windows 7 and Windows 8. Uh, and under the hood, once you get past that, that new interface, it's all the same. If you open your control panels, it's the same as Windows 7. What mm -hmm. if I have Windows Vista? and I want to get Windows 8, why wouldn't I just skip 7 altogether? Well, on your existing computer, you could do that, and, and that would be a you know, viable thing to do if you're okay with the new interface. Uh, it will be a very inexpensive upgrade, usually about $40 for the software as opposed to $100 and $150 mm -hmm. for the Windows 7 software. That's one of the reasons after the 26, the charge goes up so much, because you have to buy Windows 8, and then mm -hmm. you have to buy Windows 7 after that. So the t every year we put the holiday special together. Yeah, it's in November. In November. Mm -hmm. Every year in November we start talking about it. We haven't even sent the mail pieces yet. It's just ridiculous. But because you, know, you don't send people Christmas stuff right. before Halloween. Yeah, yeah. That's right. just wrong. So the, the 2012 holiday special is literally the biggest, baddest, best computer you can buy anywhere. We comp this same computer as close as we could get on Dell.com. Mike, take a guess. How much, how much do you think this computer <laughs> would cost on Dell.com? Uh, 699 Six hundred ninety-nine. I don't know. We sell it for fourteen ninety-nine. <laughs> I don't think I'd bring that up if that right, was the right. case. <laughs> that wouldn't would work. Would. So why don't you give us the facts so what is instead it? of having him? Six thousand dollars. Six thousand dollars. No serious? kidding. Yeah. And we sell it for fourteen ninety-nine because we're selling it at our cost during the holiday special. Holy cow! Now a lot of people are going to say, I don't need a six thousand dollar desktop, Thor. I mean, even if it is only fourteen ninety-nine, yeah. I don't. I use internet, email, word right. processing. Yeah. One of the things that we've talked about shows in the past is you never know what technology is coming tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to blow your minds a little bit. You can get something. You can learn all about this. I, not, to, not to be presumptuous, but I think you've already <laughs> blown his mind. Go ahead. If you go to a website after the show called MakerBot.com, it's a three-dimensional desktop printer that can print three-dimensional solid objects. Huh. It costs about two grand right now, so it's mm -hmm. not something you're going to buy and put in your house. but. Right. But I the mean, first CD player, you know, today's the 30-year <laughs> anniversary for CDs. The first CD player was like $800. Oh, yeah, it was know? insane. Right. And, you know, that now, now if you go online, you can see they have, uh, it looks like flour in a bin, but it's metal powder. And they have three-dimensional metal printers, too. Wow. Eventually, all that's going to come together into yeah. one unit where when you buy something online, they're just going to send the digital plan over to Kinko's or something, mm -hmm. and it's going to be printed there in the building, and you just drive down the street and pick up what you bought yeah, online. Right. right. It's not just about your so, cameras. And that's which, coming in the yeah. next 10 years. I mean, it's here now. Duncan Aviation and Lincoln uses it to print interior parts for airplanes right now. Wow. Okay, so this holiday special, uh, how do people take advantage of it? It starts today? Yeah, it's, well, it starts today. The it's pre -orders. 14. Well, it's a pre-order. So mm -hmm. when you put your money down on the table, there's only 150 of them, so we have to have you pay for it up front because otherwise, People, everybody wants one, nobody comes in to pick them up, and then we're left with a bunch of computers. So we only build 150 because we can't afford to really build well, know, not at your five cost. or 600 of them at right, our cost. Right. Uh, so basically, you come in to any of our three service centers, you can try it out. You know, if you want to try Windows 8, this is the only place in Omaha or in Lincoln that you can go into a service center mm -hmm. and actually lay hands on Windows 8 and try right, it. Right, we're 25 days away from the launch, so I think it's great now if you want to get a look at it. 
tinker around and decide Absolutely. for yourself before you make the commitment to buy eight or well, if get you seven. Like eight, if you like eight, you can wait till November. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't think we're going to sell out in October. I, I know a lot of our customers are going yeah. to want Windows 7, so we're going to sell the majority of them in October. Yeah. But I don't think, we usually sell out before Christmas, so we c it could come around to December and we don't have any holiday specials yeah. left. So mm -hmm. the first step that people need to take if they want to take advantage of that? You can check out our website, schrockinnovations.com or facebook.com slash schrockinnovations. You can get all the specs, learn all about the how the pre-order works and everything. Just come out to the service center, lay hands on it. If it's something that you want to pre-order, you can go ahead and pre-order it today, mm -hmm. and then you expect your computer to arrive about mid-November. There, there you, you have it. Shrockinnovations.com, three locations, yep. two in Omaha, one in Lincoln, uh, actually one Village Point South, and then in Papillion One in Papillion. Well. I know, I was going to say, don't tell the good people of Papillion that they live in Omaha. <laughs> yeah, they're <laughs> Omaha. News to them. Uh, <laughs> and then as Mike said, it in Lincoln, and that is the original location. And by the way, they're also on Facebook. And, uh, you know, we try to get to as much information as we can every Monday when Thor's here. Uh, but there's a lot we miss those <laughs> other four days of the week plus. So, anyway, Facebook, a good way to keep in touch. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Thor. Thank you, guys. No, you can't keep it, Mary. Oh. It's going back with. No, four. he know, he knows that ours is a dinosaur at home. So this is the one that's going back to Papillion. This is the demo. Oh, yeah, that's how go. new it is. Fancy Thank you, stuff. Thor. Thanks for coming. So some women they know a lot about cars, but most don't get into it. Yet car and.